are the most protective of the world and regulations, weary of the Thompson submachine gun, the first range of the British rate of fire. Maybe the friend gun of a smart warfare as far as the eye can see has nothing but beauty and fragrance and peace. The anti-tank light and mobile is the nightmare of the enemy air team for a living. There's no greater weapon or accurate control fire at good range than this. Even against enemy aircraft, especially when flying low, rifles and light automatics are deadly if fire is properly controlled. But with anti-aircraft fire, as with all fire, you must know when to fire if you're going to talk. First thing, let us prevent the light. Sighted up to 2,000 yards. But normally, fire should not be opened above 600 unless the target is extremely dangerous. The shorter the range, the greater the accuracy. Shoot, shoot, kill. As with the rifle, so with the friend gun. The effective range of which on its back lot is 1,000 yards. German interrogation for captured American The nearer the enemy, the greater the chance of killing. And remember, we shoot to kill with a minimum expenditure of ammunition. The end of the road. Off we go, then. To show you a practical demonstration of when you fire with the friend and rifle in defense against enemy ground. Here's a piece of the picture for which the section and defense is responsible. There's a good field of view, except for the background, which is rather fully wooded and obviously would give concealment to the end. The foreground and middle distance are quite open and give a very good field of fire. Here is our section. Can you see it? Not so on your light. Get the hospital there. right away. It's pretty bad. Yes. How about yourself? In all the years, with no effort to you get attention on some Otherwise, the we can have difficulty in spotting them at all. Everything seems to be in perfect order. The red gun has been posted on the right of the trench, with a very effective on of fire. And in the center is the corporal with his range gun. Let's have a look at it, corporal. Yes, sir. There's that wood at 800 yards. Now. You wait to start the yellow bush at 500 yards. Hey, and some gorse at 250 yards. Smash. Right. Now let's take a look at it all on the ground. On your left, your the gorse at 250 your yards. Your the bush, 500 all. yards. Yes. And the wood, 800 yards. So far, so good. And now, back in the position again. The sentry on the left of the trench scans that piece of country we've just seen for any possible movement by the enemy. He knows the yeah. ranges on that card, or he should have. And we, we can soon see how he deals with the situation if one arrives. It harm to unpack our English captain. The practice might come in handy. Hello, he seems to see yes. something. Is that the enemy moving about there? Yeah. That my vital detective. Now then, what are our deaths going to do about it? The range, remember, is 800 yards to that wall. communication lines. Bombs were jettisoned. And they crewed a remarkably fine job of destroying the plane. Hey, stop! What's yes, all that going on? With more than what are they going to do? Major, letters, they go to running back to the hospital where our position is. Then, the plane was of course were given a routine interrogation near where they were captured. Name, rank, serial number. The enemy could get one of them. Their base here. You learned nothing as to where they came from? Nothing, whatever. Our guests, I'm afraid, are thoroughly security conscious. That's what comes of not holding a fire that you're part of it. any complete information concerning future activities against us. Not one of them. Seems rather unlikely, sir. Not at all. They are for the same job. They should be guarded by men who know when to fire and who prevent them from giving vital This is another picture in the same spot. Gathering round the corporal, who is explaining to them the reference point on the radio card and then on the ground. They know nothing. Rather hope this star, then. 800 yards away, the wood ahead. I don't see how I shall learn any much about interrogation from a situation like this, Major. 500 yards, the yellow bush, with an effective rifle range and very prominent indeed. A news clipping, taken from an American newspaper we see regularly from left of our positions, the draw to 250 yards. The the American Air Force is clipped. The section is alive and watchful, and the sentry on the alert for any possible movement by the enemy. Lieutenant Williams, who happens to be one of our prisoners. Here's something. Not several Is it Jerry moving about out there? Lieutenant Williams is from Boston. Next. He comes from a fairly wealthy family, and his father, as you see, now that has a rather special hatred to the Nazi party. He had once reported to his men, who has not given the fire order as yet. The Bosch don't know that they've been spotted, so they keep on getting nearer and nearer to getting killed. 500 yards to this yellow bush, and they will probably come closer still. Who is missing? The bombardier? The corporal, observing all changes of range, verifies them by reference to his range card. The pilot himself is going to block the bombs. He's got yeah, a pretty shrewd idea that there are more to come out of that wood. And he's quite right. Here they come. Well in view at 800 yards. Yes. But no firing as yet. Not a shot from our land. Moving up nicely, aren't they? 500 yards here, remember. The they come on, quite oblivious to the presence of our position. Having placed in the hospital at once. Yes, sir. Any more for the Skylark? Yes. Here comes a more of them. Which is worth waiting for. And just shows you the value of holding your fire. I would classify him as a highly intelligent type, Keen eyes watch their every movement. As yet more of the enemy come on, so innocently into the death. Trapper could be prepared for them in the open ground ahead. And Mason, to fit for sir. I'm not quite sorry, as he thinks. Quite devoted, I would say, to his pilot command. He's acting in four years. Very good. He will segregate them at once. This fellow has been sent forward by the Jerry NCO to draw our fire and disclose the whereabouts of our men. 
waiting with brother him least of all, I might as well see him first. I can't need you for this, really. Sergeant! This frightened boy, placed him in the east wing, solitary confinement. Well done, Corporal. Get them all in that well. gap between yes, the yellow bush at 500 and the well, gorse at 250 and they won't have a hope in hell. My man's already fat. They're much simpler to soften him up. You see, Jack, each man is a different type, with a different kind of uh, chink in his armor. Once we know that chink, we know how to split that armor, and so reach the man himself. This man is wounded. He needs medical attention. He's been taken to the hospital now. Wait for it. Okay, he's getting nothing to worry about. But, in the weapons here, Simmons is icy. There's nothing wrong with Cooper. Sergeant, where are you taking him? To his brother's cabin. The meat is ready to seal. This way. What car are we going to fire, Clark? Well, that's not a good thing. That was not a good thing. That's not a good thing. Everybody in the platoon is trained to use the anti tank rifle, and any section may be detailed to carry it. Two men in each section should be the master of the I've heard what this train can Here then is the anti tank rifleman with his clever protective crew. From your same base, the anti tank rifle, we must have a good field of fire. If possible, it must less than 500 yards. Remember that the brass and flat of the rifle is a thing to be for. The muzzle must be well concealed. The anti-tank rifle position is so placed that if and when it fires, as a matter the range fact, should be considerably under 300 yards. Under the, circumstances it can be. the OPC has taken up a position from which he can fight and inform his pal of any yes, likely yes, movement by any tank. Hello, formality. what have we here? Or do you know the eyes of mine? Things you must know. Necessary rules of conduct and so on. All right, but make sure you do pick them. Let me assure you have no Tanks are like the enemy, so for heaven's sake, don't lose your head. Up the road come the tanks of the fair band. You are familiar with the German but we haven't got any over here. Well, in a general way, yes. So we're using light footage one for our prisoners, prisoners, I believe. If we handle yes. this carefully, it's in the back. Let's hope the rifleman doesn't fire too soon. Excuse me. Yeah, oh, I'm right. Hey, oh, I'm not here, not here. Hey, I'm 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 not here. All he's done is to give his blood to the world. He's worked with his way and went, trying to make out where the party's gone. I'm wondering what it's all about. Thank for the personal reason has been always wanted. And I'll give it. As you go to the undergrowth, it carries out a flanking attack on the position. And Bob's run. This call was sent to a new turret on his headquarters. Then called by the... That's one tank to the good and one anti-tank rifleman definitely to the bad. 
you the honest truth. There we are. What is the fault of the rifle? It is an arrow. Our anti-tank rifle is a very good weapon, and the best in the world for the public to come to. Let us see how these weapons should be. The same defensive position, the same view of the fire, but by a rifleman who knows his job. Charles the same. There's his OPC on the job. This is his field of view. Here I'm here to the road towards the field. Thanks. Okay. The rifleman springs to action and covers the rest. According to the Geneva Convention, I give a name. I remain aware that I will take everything away from her. Them from the sky. The rifle can quickly go from the front of the aim and fire. Take 
turn around, and fully charge the enemy is doing immense damage to their cross iron cage bomber. But for this reason, all strikes when on the mark are set at 500 yards against the enemy on the ground. So with the rain gun, taking instructions from the heavens of the building, taking the heavy plane and hacking around the rest. What's in this room over here? Somewhere in England, the platoon is on the line of march. With AA formation, making every use of cover, and with a gas of air sentry marching on the way down, and with a line of air sentry marching on the way down, and with a line of air sentry marching on the way down, and with a line of air sentry marching on the way down, and with a line of air sentry marching on the way down, and with a line of air sentry marching on the way down, and up goes the curtain on Act 1. You read American stories? I missed it. Americans! Aircraft action, and the platoon springs to it, drawing into cover on either side of the road. Yes, I don't know about that. Section leaders order aircraft hunt. So far, so good. There we go again. Opening up on those planes must be a good 4,000 feet. Do they look close enough for you? Well, my one means to be a from up there. They are mighty high. They can only spot you at that rate because you've given the opposition away. You are Floyd and you've got it. And lucky you aren't bombed up as well. Oh, it's a wonderful town. It's quite a bit different than it was in the Brooklyn. But while all this has been going on, the only plane in the whole sector of the sky has come crashing down to earth. One section of rifle men about now. The sky is behind them with a meditated attack. They were forward kept and wheeled around. They knew when to fire. And this is how they did it. Thank you.